Good morning, saints of God. Let's continue our Bible study today in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. So we're talking uh, about uh, Ephesians 6, that we are, we have a spiritual opponent, a spiritual enemy. And God has, all, which is the devil, and God has also provided for us weaponries and armories to put on. So we talked the other day about the utility belt to put on your belt of truth. And I talk about the breastplate of righteousness. So all these weaponries, yesterday I talk about your gold boots. That means your gospel shoes to put on. And today we are talking about the shield of faith. So let's see the scripture today. What it says here in the book of Ephesians uh, 6. And, uh, okay, so it continues here that we should be careful about the wives of the devil. So here it says that above all, taking the shield of faith, wherein you shall be able, be able to quench all the fairy dart of the wicked one, which is the enemy. So all the fairy dart is his lies. Because all this standing against, standing against is the lies of the devil. So the Bible says so that you can put on the whole armor of God so that you can be able to stand against the wise, that means lies of the devil. So this spiritual enemy, you must have faith in God. That is very important. You have to take your shield. This shield is a big shield that cover you front and back. This shield, you, the Bible says shield, um, the shields will, uh, will protect you from the enemy. So that shield is big enough to cover you, right? And then if the enemy is shooting his fairy dart, you are using your shield, plong, 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 all his fairy dart can be sickness, disease, lies, fear, depression. It can be so many things. So you have to put your shield up. Shield up, shield up, amen, hallelujah, shield up in the name of Jesus, you stay behind your shield in the name of Jesus, because that means you have faith in God, that shield means I have faith in God, Abraham believed God, it was counted for him for righteousness, so read the book of Hebrews 11, Romans 4, you will see all the heroes of faith there, so you have to believe God, you must trust in God, Jesus Christ said himself that have faith in God, so you must have faith in God, because you don't have to be afraid, fear comes from the enemy, faith comes from God, perfect love casts out fear, amen, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, so shield up, shield up, shield up all the time, amen, in Jesus Christ's mighty name, you have your faith in 